छूटा हाल हमारा जाने है He is known as the king of ghazal and even today Pakistani maestro Mehdi Hasan's melodious voice rings the right notes as it used to way back in the 50s and the 60s Born in 1927 in a village called Luna in then Rajasthan into a family of traditional musicians Mehdi Hasan's journey has been full of trials and tribulations After partition when his family moved to Pakistan Hasan worked at a bicycle shop to make ends meet But it was in the year 1952 when he got an opportunity to sing at a radio station. Though Hasan started as a Tumri singer, his love for Urdu poetry led him to ghazals. From the early 1960s to the late 1980s. Hasan's popularity soared as he became one of the most sought after playback singers in the Pakistani film industry. Following severe illness in the late 80s, Hasan cut back on playback singing. Only to return with his album Sarhade in October 2010. Which incidentally includes Tera Milna, perhaps his first and last duet with Lata Mangeshkar. An icon of ghazal gaayki, Hasan has been bestowed with many laurels like Tamgha e Imtiyaz, Hilal e Imtiyaz by the government of Pakistan and Gorkha Dakshina Bahu by the government of Nepal. <laughs>